Well, it seems that Elon Musk isn't content to be just a shareholder in Twitter. Now he says he wants to buy the company. Today, he announced a cash offer to buy the social media giant. And CBS 2's Tina Ezzedine is live right now in Santa Monica with the terms of Elon's offer. Tina. That's right. While the main headquarters are in San Francisco, behind me in this nondescript building in Santa Monica are some offices where they do sales here for Twitter. And the employees could not speak publicly today, but they did indicate that they were not surprised by this move. Mr. Musk rejected on Saturday a seat on the board. Analysts say it gave an indi indication as to his intentions here today. So now you could say that there is a fight for the control of Twitter, and it's all about one character. It is a $43 billion offer, cash, from the richest man in the world to buy Twitter. A few hours later, Elon Musk spoke at a TED Talk in Vancouver. It's just really important that people have the, both the, uh, the reality and the perception uh, that they are able to speak freely within the bounds of the law. The Tesla CEO saying the social media company needs to be taken private to ensure that it is a platform for free speech. Anyone's opinion that goes against, uh, I don't know, the politicians' norms gets blocked, gets censored. Video gets taken down. So I don't know, maybe it's a good idea. Business and financial observers note if Musk takes the company private, he won't have a fiduciary responsibility to its shareholders. I think this is a really interesting moment of a hostile takeover of a company to bring it private so he has control over it. On the social media platform, Musk's bid was the top trending topic. Critics from comedians to political ethic watchdogs chiming in on the offer. As one of Twitter's largest shareholders, Saudi billionaire Al Walid bin Talal stating, quote, I reject this offer. In Santa Monica, where Twitter holds a small sales office, employees said they could not comment. Wednesday's closing price was more than $45 a share. Musk's offer is a little more than $54 a share. A compelling one for shareholders to get out from the stock that has been underperforming. It might increase a bit to kind of, you know, entice the shareholders to, you know, to, uh, you know, to, 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 to take the bid. And who knows, they might. From a billionaire who once said owning Twitter would be misery. Despite today's news, investors were not immediately convinced. Uh, stocks fell 2% in afternoon trading. As for his part, Mr. Musk said on Twitter today, quote, this is my final and best offer. Live in Santa Monica, I'm Tina Ezzedine, CBS 2 News. All right, Tina, thank you.